It was presumed lost more than half a century ago. Now a large watercolour by renowned artist Sir Hans Heysen has been returned to Australia from Germany. The work has just been unveiled in Adelaide and experts predict it'll break records when it goes to auction. In Adelaide, Caroline Winter reports. With the Flinders Rangers in the background, a flock of sheep in the foreground, with a shepherd and his horse resting under ancient gum trees, the camp at Winoka Creek is without a doubt a signature Sir Hans Heysen. It just shows you know, clearly what a master watercolourist Heysen was and such a beautiful draftsman. I mean, you look at the, uh, the, the, the trees, the way he's aligned it with the, uh, the backdrop, it's just the most beautiful piece of draftsmanship alone. Alan Campbell is curator at the Heysen Home and Gallery, The Cedars, in the Adelaide Hills, and says at 55 by 74 centimetres, this is believed to be his largest work. One of Australia's best-known landscape artists, Sir Hans Heysen's work was often inspired by the Flinders Rangers, and that's where this piece was painted in 1932, during the first of his 11 trips there. It remained in the artist's collection for 26 years, but a recording in his personal ledger gives a small hint about what happened next? That's the bill of sale, 115 pound 10 shillings in June 1958. Well, it's a bit of a mystery you know, as to how it was found in Germany. My hypothesis, as I've said to Jim, is that it was given as a gift by James McGregor, Sir James, to a corresponding German entrepreneur or whatever, because he was pretty high up in the wool industry. And do we know how long it may have been in Germany before it's been returned here? I don't think we do, Jim. Do no, I don't know, but one can, one can presume that Sir James gave so many things away. He was quite a philanthropist, so I'm sure it would have been gifted around the period that it was purchased. So it hasn't been seen again on the Australian market. That's Adelaide art dealer Jim Elder, a specialist in Heysen sales. He says the painting was bought from a deceased estate in Dusseldorf and the new owner contacted him to sell the piece. It'll go under the hammer next month, but just what it will fetch, Jim Elder isn't sure. The record for uh, a watercolour by Heysen is 150000 We know it will bring a record price for South Australia. I think the South Australia record is about 60000 there hasn't been a work like this sold. We've had 40,000 for works a lot smaller and less important. Uh, we don't know. Until then, the piece will hang in the Elder Gallery to be admired by many, not least Alan Campbell. A magnificent watercolour, I think one of the finest watercolours I've seen of Heysen's work in the Flinders Ranges. And it's a fair beauty. And if I could just ask you finally three words to describe it? Two, a masterpiece. <laughs> a Heysen masterpiece, three be wonderful to see it. That's Alan Campbell, curator of the Heysen Home and Gallery, ending Caroline Winter.